Yeah, no, fuck that shit. Not going there. Nope. Signorina, I am having like a thousand children to see you. What the fuck? Tampoon. There is no response. All right, so I know the interest in this game was not all that super high, but um, I'm, I want to play it. It's a very interesting game. I'll try to edit out a little bit more of um, stuff that might be boring to watch, I guess. We'll see. Oh, I made it worse. I wonder if he left something. Because that was one thing that I just sort of uh, glazed over. Yeah. There's a calling card hidden inside the hat. Oh. I am half a magician without you. The hat. May I be permitted to, to the enhanced pleasure of entertaining you this evening. You complete me. Lorenzo the Great. Do we take a picture? So I don't have to go into the settings all the time. Someone pointed out that one of the critiques that this game got was the... Um, man at gate crossed over. Good. Now we're gonna go up the stairs unless they are done with their conversation. Hi, Doko. Bye-bye, Doko. Yeah, they're still going. Okay, so we're gonna go upstairs. Okay. Hmm. An animal terrible, terrible. A horrible animal. If you read it backwards. It is a okay, It's not 200. Damn. Who'd have thunk? Exhibition opening 2014. That was 10 years ago. Give me. Why is it broken? I guess we visit the exhibition on the second floor. Uh, uh, yeah, but... What was this? Sorry, excuse me, what? Did they both just leave the same? Oh. I guess it, what the... It is a look at it. Oh. One, two, three, four. Order. A dog like all other dogs. Hmm. Andre Plan. Oh, shoot. I don't know what those tubes are. Bolted from the other side. It's a shortcut, huh? Oh, hi! There's a hole in the forehead of the sculpture. Do you want, do you want a tampon? <laughs> yeah, sorry. The fact that I can't move these annoy me a lot. Dola! All right, cool. Uh, if this one started to move, started to move. I don't know. Did I play this one with controller before? I don't feel like I did. Did I? I don't remember. All I remember is that I was getting annoyed at this that I couldn't. Why is it red here if I can't take anything here? So maybe they have improved the controllers a bit in the game. If they were critiqued for it. It is a lucky day. I mean... Meeting for the seven. Guess what? <laughs> it is a lucky day. Bolted from the other side, of course. Of course, he said it is bolted from the other side. It is a locket. 
Here, take a dollar. No. There's no bribing the door. There's no one there. You want some coffee? I really don't. I feel like I would run past a lot of stuff. This one's different. Still no zero 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 zero. How how are they always bolted from the other side? Dollar? No. All right, it's cool. I'm really just running through this household. I remembered some. Oh. Hi, uh, excuse me, I want to uh, remove my coat first. Coat has been removed, now we can talk. Signorina, I am up in like a thousand children to see you, what the fuck? Look at his uh, suspicious appearance. Mm, what are the single gentlemen? Please forgive my absence and your appearance. I had some matter I needed to discuss with the Americans, Bob Burger. Ask about the red substance, ask about the telephone call project, ask about the dog! <laughs> first things first, Signorina. <laughs> you must above all get to know this house. After all, it is your art that will reveal all its secret and mem memories. Alright, uh, this is a crucial to the project. Keep quiet. Shut up. Now, Signorina, if you would, excuse me, as you can see, uh, raindrops fall on man and hedgehog hog alike, okay? I have to go and clean off this red paint. Yeah. Call me <laughs> on my room number about your findings. We must uncover everything. Who are you? In your room 1963. Signorina, you will, of course, be needing your room key. I left it in the reception desk. Hi, good luck, my love. You nasty. Calling me all kinds of stuff, you weirdo. Now can we go in here? We can. Let's save. Log out there. Huh? I don't think I need to call anyone right now. Is it bolted from the other side? Oh, surprising. Dola. To whom it may concern, Los Angeles, January 1963. That's our room. It has come to our attention that Mr. Nero has con con has contracted uh -huh. You to work on his uh, project. We are writing to let you know that we are not involved in any capacity with Mr. Nero nor any of his projects as of late last year, so 1962. Yeah. Late last year, I mean, so it's like the past month. Anyone choosing to still associate with Mr. Nero after receiving this letter will be regarded as complicit in Mr. Nero's game. Furthermore, my personal advice for you, for your own safety, is to not engage with Mr. Nero, as it, it, as it has proven time after time that his behavior is erratic, perhaps even dangerous. Sincere Robert Sidney. Sounds good, yeah. Seven, two, three, five. Oh. Huh. Oh. Interesting. Yeah, but I can't make it a... Uh... Hmm. How do I... Um... No? Let 
Maybe it's 1962. Yeah. Late of last year. They were celebrating. Dola. Oh. 2014. See, now our body temp is better because we removed the jacket. And I only really like made that uh, connection when editing last time. You can take off the jacket. Oh, you could have done it here too. Maybe. Yes, but this time I have more than a tampon. I let this go. Oh god. Go out, go out, go out. Do I... Hi! He's fast asleep. No. Let her fucking sleep. What the fuck is wrong with you? It is a broken. Oh, like my dreams. Do I try to scan it? <laughs> Let's do it. No, it doesn't recognize a QR code anyway. No. Bad. Scan all the QR codes, kids. It's not dangerous. Can we climb it? Yes, we can. Look at her being athletic. Oh no. Lofe te winde. Did we wake her up? No. We snoop? Yes. Oh my god, there's a stack of empty cassette boxes. Oh! 1962. Nice. How could he have written the book and done the interview in 1960 if the movie was released in 62? Nineteen fifty, fifty-two. Card fell out. Ace of Hearts. Yeah. Fifty-four. All right, that's good. The third eye. Yeah. But there's a note inside. Cinema sostenuto manifesto. Cinema does not need people to exist, okay? Sure. A piece of art exists in itself and for itself. No, all art can and should not be for mankind. Yes. <laughs> we must make special cinema for showing movies that transcends the human experience and shift the perspective from the viewer. Such a cinema has no need for chairs or popcorn, okay? Sure. And it has no room or need for people at all. Okay. A projectionist stars the film uh, starts the film and is given ample time to <laughs> to vacate before the credits, okay? Then the show begins. No chatter, no commercial, no inane questions about the plot. Pure cinema. Untarnished by the greedy eyes. I don't know. There is no cassette. Uh, tampon? She's super obsessed with that. Alright. Let's wake up the old lady. Hi, I'm here to scare you. Oh, Jesus Christ. What the fuck? Young woman, before I go, please help me see. The, the, the fuck you want me to do? Alright. Yeah. Date of admission. Miss Blah suffers from Blah and Blah. The latter is believed to be a symptom of early stages of blah. 
It is likely that Miss Bra's condition is Bra. Lately, Miss Bra has been <laughs> receptive to verbal communication. Nurses are seen not not as well their reactions when mentioning such things as family members, friends, places she has visited, and things related to her work. As, as it is believed that this verbal stimuli is beneficial for Miss Bra, the care team intends to find more information about Miss Bra. Visitors will be encouraged to communicate with Miss Bra using any verbal stimuli the care team finds advisable. Schöner tag, like Schrödinger. Name of the place you used to visit. Find out name of parents. Any other family, aunt or uncle perhaps. Projects worked on the names or nicknames of friends, acquaintances, etc. Find out about the exhibitions. Any specific uh, contribution in exhibitions. Music she likes. Band names. Mm, Leda. She's mumbling. Listen. The peace at the electric arte symposium. Cafe, photo exhibition. Mother, her sister, and father. Sculpture projects, tail legs, names, dolphins, band. Alright, she's just saying the same thing. I'm not giving up on you. Do, 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 do. Tampoon! There is no response. You're on saving now, old lady. Alright, cool. How was your room, Signorina? Jesus, I, you left me the wrong key. Was it what you expected? Explain that there was someone in there. Compliment the room choice. You really like puzzles, Senorita. Let me think. Hmm. I've got it. You were the someone. Sorry? That was an in in inventive riddle, Bella. Now, Senorita. I forgot to ask you the most important thing. Did you bring the script script pages like we agreed? I mean, there was no agreement. Senorina, senorina. This is a problem bigger than a jackpot. A very big problem. How do you suppose we will find out how it ends? I suggest you make it a very high priority to bring them to me. Bring you what? Okay, so the plot is... This is us. Right? That's the thing. So we are... We are... Right? That sort of feels like... Um, that's us. That's that's Laura. Laura lie with the razor or red eyes and... Uh, now we're wandering around and only remembering us as the youth young person, right? Cracked it! I'm a genius. Also, where's the door? Yeah, no, fuck that shit, not going there. Nope. Dup, 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 Nope, 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 nope. Uh, <laughs> holy crap. I talk like a 1957. Let's see here. It is a login. Yes. What? What? Uh, 34 minutes, okay. <laughs> he transformed himself to a Labrador. Oh. In post-war Düsseldorf, the homeless Rudy looks for his blind dog, Lazarus, in the ruined city. As Rudy 
realizes the dogs have more value than him, he transforms himself into a Labrador only to find himself in a constant fear of being cooked and served in a fancy restaurant. <laughs> so good. It's a drama too. <laughs> um. Okay, so it's not that. Well. Damn. A uh, damn. You. I don't have anything for you. You don't have anything for me. So I guess we're even, Steven. No. Yeah, and that was, what, 1962. But backwards, because it's backwards, right. Oh, I get it! Nice! Okay, I get it. Now I get it. Ho, ho, ho! Big brain... Oh, shit. Nope. Ah. Uh, that's surprising. Hmm, January 9th, 1847. Dear Boada, my worries were not without cause. Things have started to appear. A red hallway behind a clock, a theater. The Baronin. Baronin is changing and speaks in a puzzling tongue. Hmm. Minutes and hours are years. At this very moment, time is the year. She said, as if it it was a rehearsed line from a play. The Crimson Beast skulks these halls now, playing strange games and whispering horrible words. It wants to swallow all. Tonight, if such a time even exists, we are invited to a performance, something will happen, there is violence in the air. Ab imo pectore, your brother. I will never remember the name of my brother. It is at a couple of the day. Okay, that gives us nothing. Minutes and hours are years. Okay. So. No. Perfect, that's good. Uh, so, a dog. One, two, three, four, yeah. So, it's third, first, fourth, and second. Three, one, four, two. So, it's... Eight, one, seven. Yeah, cool. Ah, oh, I like that. That's pretty cute. Oh, another one. Helpful. Huh. Ah, right, so that one is increasing by sixty. This one is increasing by nine. And this one by 400. Hmm, dear brother. I arrived at Pana yesterday. It is decaying dark and much too large for the Baroni Baronin herself. Your prophecy was as expected, correct? She is an artist born on these very grounds. I have yet to gain her trust, but in but I sense an in, inexplicable bond between us. I think she knows that what I am searching for, as as is expected, for how could one live forty years on sacred grounds without knowing? Ab imo pectore. Okay. So 1847, so that's 1807, do you think?
This one is jumping in. Yeah, good. Disket. Floppy disks, right? In English, we call it disket. Computer disk. I mean, yeah. If you want to be a nerd about it. Okay, so that's uh, that. That was the hint here then. Minutes and hours are years. Okay, so eighteen forty-seven. So just eighteen forty-seven. Yeah. Cool. Like a 24 24 hour clock. Computer disk. We're just gonna go around and gather those again. That's our new objective. Also, I wanted to go in here. Yes. Oh, ah. Do you have my script? Lay them under the door. Can't seduce this man. It's impossible. We don't have a hint for this one at all. But that one is also looking different because it's just a three... Three digit one. Ah. Do we have any more posters? I thought this was fun. 1847, we also don't have a... That was just a bolt of bullshit. Wait, so what are the names on these scrolls? Tredev... Tredev... Voynin... Hmm... Available components and prices. Okay, so I have to put it together to see what the price will be. Uh. Aha, okay, so the least expensive option is to make that whole module up there. To calculate the area, yeah, but it's upside down. Alright, so... Malmö, Sverige. I didn't see that until now. Ritning godkänd av tredje vod... Aha, there you see. Kjell Area, okay. So this is this one. So, which ones do we think would fit the... Report cost to client. So this first module doesn't work. The one that says 50, that doesn't work. The second one doesn't have enough windows. The third one... No, it'd have too many windows. Fourth one... Doesn't have a door. So it's 330. Uh, plus... It's not the last one that says 275 anyway. And it's not the second to last, the 60, because it doesn't have a window. And it's not the 500 one. It's 85 or 400. Four, oh, it's a three windows. Oh, it's a 400. 330 plus 400, so 730. Let's try it. Oh, 
Yes, okay, cool. All right, so what the hell is this? Oh. Oh, shit. 248. Ho, ho, ho. Thank you for that. Oh, that's an open door. It is a locket. Yeah, but not for long. Oh. <laughs> a big brain tune for me. Oh, oh, oh. Do we have a dollar? Ugh. One and two. One and eight. There's a note next to the device. Input case sensitive code to request bug report 2. Um. Do we have any other hint? It's just these guys. One night. Thirty one lay. Hmm. One night. One and two. Thirty-one lay. Thirty-one and two. One and eight, so one and eight, two. Thirty-one lay and thirty-one and two. So why do you have thirty-one lay? You would have thirty-one lay. Or 31L2, not N2. Hmm. One and two. So one N, one N2. 31 lay, and then you would have 31L2. Did you have N2? Why? But I can't punch in numbers anyway. Can't punch in numbers. That's a problem. Hmm. Yeah, no. It's a revisit puzzle because I can't. Right, uh, ghost lady. <laughs> or live ice, gnome. Yeah, she is. Granite. In Gnome, we are invited to see the thoughts of a person as they are formed. Nine slates, some containing letters, forming a seemingly nonsensical word, seems to grow as ideas on the subject's forehead. The piece is cryptic, even a maze like, and ultimately lets us use our imagination to project our own ideas onto its slate. So narrow. Yeah. Okay, so it's gonna be a puzzle. Um, I think we took from the 1963 door. There was a... a maze, but I don't know. Let's just follow the ghost lady, I guess. Oh, wait. 
Well, hold on, gold lady. Oh, shit. Five. No, it was wrong. Oh, no. Okay. We'll follow ghost lady. Yeah, we're not gonna die. Ooh. Number six. I don't know if we had... Um, Hold on. Um, yeah, we did write this one down. Number six was 67. Because it got six edges on the outside of the black one and then seven on the inner one. So, yeah. It is a log, it's not for long. There we go. Good. Gonna do a little shine that we unlocked it. Uh, don't even know where we are. Dola. Pulled it from the other side. That was it. I don't... Okay. Sure. <laughs> the whole block's the way. American dollar. Yeah. Just going around and gathering coins. Oh my god, okay. Um so it's nineteen something seven. So it's 1847. Yeah. What So L is 50 and X is 10. So it's minus because it's before. So it should be. Why not? Oh, oh, okay, I see. Eighteen forty-seven. So it's if you look at the picture up there, it's like one eight four seven is actually in seven five eight three. Yeah. Cool. That's the picture. What the fuck? When did this turn into a horror game? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. When? I'm sorry. When? What happens if we pull them? What the fuck? Uh. Tell him about the dead person. Red glass shards around her. She is holding onto a broken key. Fuck if I know. <laughs> yeah. We'll just revisit your body and fix the puzzle later. What the fuck? Frank? What the fuck? We're completely normal about this? Uh, yeah, that's fine. There's a hole in the forehead of the statue. You know what goes there. Damn. Can I take the key? E-shaped key? Okay.
There's a keypad next to the gate. Yeah. Uh, where's my pen? 1847. Same one as the other one. Hmm. So if N is 4... What the fake letter is that? Let's say it's west, because it's the only thing that makes sense to me, is N through N, so that's 1. East is south minus, minus west, and south is north plus north, which is 8, and then east is 7. No, yes, because 8, uh, south minus west is Seven. Hmm. Okay, so that's north, south, east, and west, right? So it's still not like eighteen forty-seven. It is eighteen is west. I mean, one is west, and eight eight is south. 4 is north, and 7 is west. No? North, south, east, west. I can never remember, so... 1847. There we go. It's just me being stupid. Did I miss a dollar? Is there a dollar in this thing? No? Okay. Yeah, I want to go into this tent. So at this point, she realized she fucked up. Oh god, modern astrology. I think uh, this could help us in one of the puzzles in the library. Meteorites from the Tertius Octolus are still found on Earth to this day. In the Rubrum Astronomica, Lucius writes, When the third eye passes us by, the world belongs to creators. It's a time for beauty and chaos. An artist will be crowned king and he will lead our victory over Mammon. He will create items of great beauty and for a, ref for a fleeting moment there will be harmony in chaos. But order will be restored and knights of the third eye end in blood. Artists will die or surrender to the merchants. Mammon will not be denied, but artifacts of these knights will remain among us. Yeah. American dollar. <laughs> of course. Of course Mammon was among the pages. <laughs> the Zodiacs, who are we? Uh oh Well, shit. Yes, Gemini, that's me. In the cards, okay. The Ace of Spades, also known as a death card or the sp Spadille. Spadille. In Swedish, had we said Spadille. Has been a symbol of a symbol related to war and also asexuality, but in the French tradition of fortune telling, it would usually mean bad luck or death in one's future. Of course, of course. Card fell out. <gasps> Oculum Oculomancy. It uh, it is it is in the eyes, okay. There is of course more to Oculomancy than simply reading the reflection of the questioner's eyes. Over the next chapters we will learn about what an octo Oculomancer can tell about a soul by the shape of their eyes, the color of their irises, and how we can provide spiritual guidance by studying the nuances in the bloodshot eye and, uh, the, uh, and the structure of the vessels. Sure, dude. Oh no, more books. The Skeptic Guide to Crystal Gazing. To understand crystalloma crystallomancy, we must understand that all... 
uh, divinity is therapeutic, not paranormal. Over the years, we have uh, there have been several scientific studies on the practice. And many come to the same conclusion. Crystal gazing is self-hypnotism. Hypnotism. Sure. What you see in the crystal could simply be something you have forgotten or repressed. So basically take a moment to reflect, right? Uh, transcendental number or blah, blah, blah. Uh, one is divine, nine is death, six is life and three is creation. Three, six, nine. Creation, life and death. Combining them tells us 1963, that's the room number. Got it. Yeah. Combining this tells us about the holy power and vision, visions within each person and how to use them in uh, creativity. This is then the year for create, creation at all costs, life or death. To those willing to see it, 1963 is the year of finality and new beginnings. My mom was born in 1963. Uh, seven, move, seven moving astronomical objects. Okay. Oh. Uh, it is believed that uh, that the Babylon Babylonians were the first to divide the moon phase cycle in four, which became what we today know as a week. Okay, they also developed the horos horoscope by assigning them the seven classic planets. Yeah, because the moon is the planet, sure. Moon, Mars, Mercury, Jupiter, Venus, Saturn, and Sun. I mean, sure, babe. Sure. Lunar phases of 1847. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, I see. Hmm. That will be for the puzzle in the library. Not here. Call me. 1798. A voice echoes from within the crystal wall. I see your destiny. I see island. Caves. Your tragic fate leads you to an island far away. Sulavesi. In the cave where this started thousands of years ago. Do you wish to hear more? Yeah, go. The year is 1982. You will wander the path of that prime. Do you hear the cave? Primordial cave. You will go north. You will go east. You will go south. Or you will go west. Oh. What are we doing? At this point you will see... I just took random, I didn't... Absolutely nothing! <laughs> I love it. 1798. Uh, where do you have the American dollar? We don't want to go further. Oh, wait, hold on. Did we not have a picture? But where do we start? We don't know where we're starting.
dun 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 Like, what is this? No, I didn't want to do that. But all those donkeys look really scary. Uh, hi, dead lady! That's a seven. Eighteen. Oh, so eighteen was correct. Because I think it got further in, right? There we go. 1847. Just gonna take your key, lady. Oh, but... It said right there on the ground, I'm blind. Stupid. Wait, there's a... Oh, wait, we already went there. We got a crack for some reason. But I think that's gonna be it. I don't want to make the episodes too long. And I'm cutting out the... I don't know if I had a lot of thinking process this time, but the... And that's gonna be it. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!